Welcome to another process video from Freddie. There he is and myself. Today I'm going to be making these large fabric buttons. We can use our fabric scraps. It's another one of those projects, even little tiny scraps will be great for this. So yeah, let me bring you closer and let me show you. It's a very gentle and simple project. So I think it'll be quite a comfort. Oh, let me show you. Let me show you my process. Of course, it's slow stitching. So again, no right or wrong. But what I've been doing to make these buttons, if you can see, they've got a nice texture to them. Let me show you how I did that. Now, you might have other ideas and that that you want to use, but let me show you. So I get a little scrap. And then I pop it through here. Check out Maria on Instagram. This has got very Maria K. I'll leave her link below. This has got very Maria K vibes to it, I think. And let's just sew that in like that. So it's, that's it, in and out, any stitch, any stitch goes. So it's in there now. So what I'm going to do is scrunch it up could say it's a ruffle. I was going to scrunch it up and then I'm just going to stitch and stitch. Now you can do this neatly round and round or just randomly. Just however you, however you feel comfortable. If you look on the back of this one, can you see how random the stitches are on it? <laughs> I haven't put a backing on that one yet. So yes, just any stitch goes and you just keep building it up. If it goes over the edge, don't worry because you can trim it off afterwards and again this if you need it to be can be a nice portable project hmm. and yeah I'm just going over those ruffles so yeah it hasn't really got any sticky up bits but it seems to just have quite a lot of Quite a lot of texture. And then you just carry on like that. Round and round. Until it's all full up. Now, when it gets to the centre, I like to put a light piece of fabric in the middle so that you can do this buttony piece there. For the buttony piece, I've chosen full thickness, so that's six strands of a darker colour. And I'm just going to go in and do like a cross in the middle, like a button, like a button with thread in. And I'm going to go over that a few times so it's nice and thick and it shows up. I do like a big button. Let's have a look. Oh yes. Let's have a look in the tin. Oh, 
this was a big button. Maybe it was a bit plain and I have done some sticking on it, stuck some, a napkin on it. Look at these. Gorgeous, aren't they? That is huge. Oh, it's nearly the size of this one. So it is possible to have buttons that big. Oh, I love those. Mm. Mm. I know. Oh, that, can you remember get? No, you didn't get these from the button skip, did you? No, I didn't but, get any um, of these. You got other treasures from the. I got different things to you, well, I think. Yeah, yeah. And which ones are you going to choose, Melanie? Do you? I just want that one, to be honest. Oh, have more than one. Yeah. No, I don't need more than one. Yeah. That's, that's good. Oh, oh, okay. That one just reminds me a little bit of, of like a Cindy Doll toilet seat. <laughs> Cindy <laughs> Doll. <laughs> it does with the wooden. <laughs> Oh, you are funny. <laughs> Which one do I get? Would they actually work as buttons? I don't. I I don't see how. I don't see how. Even if you kind of like criss, or maybe maybe if you crisscrossed. Yeah, but they've still only got that much room to. Yeah. But I, if you if you just use two, if you use like two there mm. and two there mm. and crisscrossed. Yeah. Then you'd have. Yeah. Oh, take more than one because I think you might have fun with them in your slow stitch journal, yeah? I'm going to take some more of the thread. I make up my own little bobbins sometimes. Just out of recycled greetings cards, the, these are, yes. Another nice thick piece of cotton, six strands. Well, it's embroidery thread. I just don't know what it is. I think it's, I seem to be doing thing, my, my art, my sewing and my collage and painting with, with circles these days. You just go through phases, don't you? It's just what pleases me at the moment. Oh, hmm. And yes, I've just gone all the way round the edge with that dark thread. It's quite nice if it shows up. You can use any colour thread you like. There are no... The thing with this is, there are no rules. Yeah. Flo, what are you doing at the moment? Are you doing slow stitching? Oh, yes. Oh, I can see you've got your feet crossed. You're relaxing. I like your apron, actually, Flo. It's all to me. Oh, I love it. And it's got a handy pocket. It's lovely. Oh, you're slow stitching. You're using little scraps. and Oh, lovely. Finally stitching that in. Wonderful. She's always busy, isn't she? Oh. Now, oh, when you're doing this, just make sure you're not all crunched up over and your shoulders are tense. And Oh, just take a, a nice breath and a cup of tea, maybe. Mm. You might be sewing. You might just be relaxing. Or catching up on jobs, maybe. This goes to show there is no right or wrong. I did the outside stitch and I haven't backed it. So let me just, yeah, I'll cut round this, get the backing. Depends what you're using it for. I'm going to back mine because I might be using them for brooches. And, do you know, they would actually serve as buttons. I'm going to be putting some in my slow stitch journal as well. Cut round there. There we are. Just 
There we are. It means I'll have another another row of dark stitches and that's fine. Lovely. And I can load up my tray to take to the lounge or my stitch and go set. And these are just gentle little projects to do. I think we need some gold, don't you? Oh, we've got some lovely vintage pets today. How lovely. Excuse me, I think I need some thick strands of gold. Thank you for guarding it for me. Oh, you, if you haven't got gold, use what you have, different coloured threads. I'm using the, the quite nice thick strands, six strands of embroidery, metallic embroidery thread. It's quite nice to have a shine. Oh, you might want to add beads to yours, little seed beads. Should we have a nice cup of tea together now? Yeah, face to face. Yes, definitely. Let's do that. Oh, these are just so relaxing to make. I know you're going to, to enjoy them, but yeah, maybe when the time's right. The most important thing is create what makes your heart happy. Have a little play. Mm. I've got these lovely oaty biscuits. My lovely neighbour Sandra bought them in from Ikea. She came in the other day and sat across from me and did some, we did some creating together and had had a little bit of lunch and her mum came in too and sat on the chair over there. Oh, it's lovely, really lovely. Mm. Well, have we got... Oh, oh, I'd forgotten. I used one of the buttons as a brooch. Yeah, I thought I had another one somewhere. I'm not quite sure where it's gone. But you like that, you lose things. Yeah, yeah. It'll turn up. It'll turn up. Mm. Shall we light the candle? Mm. Now, we're all different, aren't we? And just, whilst I light the candle, just use it in a way that helps you and suits you might want to think about yourself or you might have like a list of other people that are on your heart at the moment. Thank you. I do appreciate you being here as being together and yeah. Oh, it's lovely. Really lovely. Mm. I'm definitely going to be continuing with these. It's that round and round motion, I think. Yeah. Go through phases, don't we? Yeah, create what makes your heart feel happy. I do hope you get a little bit of time just for you this week. Mm. 
Take care, everyone. Bye. I found the perfect little home for Origami Freddy, made by Carol's mum. Ah, oh, it's lovely. With the other little portraits of Freddy. <laughs> I love it. Ah, oh, this is in my hallway. It's his ears, isn't it, Melanie? It's his ears are so beautiful. They're so silky. Hello, my Paul. <laughs> I just want to hold Paul. Stop poking my ears now. Oh, Freddie's got a visitor, haven't you, Freddie? Yeah, a little Mel Joy visit. Mm. <laughs> he's not sitting down. No, he's not sitting down. Yet. Oh, Mum's just ordered me to sit down when recording. <laughs> okay. Fine. All right. Okay, we'll sit like? down. Okay, we got the direct here. Um, what? Have you, oh, yeah. what did you just move there? Oh, uh, yes. Tim Tams. Yeah. Ben, we like Tim Tams. What's the They're best good. thing about New Zealand? The Tim Tams. The Tim Tams. <laughs> the Tim Tams are actually... Access to Tim Tams. The, the, the yeah. Tim Tams are from um, Australia. They're not... Oh. They're, not, they're Australian. Yeah, yeah, okay, they're not yeah. New Zealand. No, they're no, 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 no. But anyway, yeah. you like Tim Tams. Yeah. Would you like to know what I've been making? Oh, you don't me? actually want to know the, the favourite thing about New Zealand. Oh, see, this, this Tim is, Tams. See, mum, see mum, mum doesn't really take an interest in that. Oh. <laughs> No, what are you doing? No, 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 no. What was it? I thought it was you answered the tune. No, uh, okay. seriously, yeah. Ben. What, um, my needle thread. I thought it was in a pin. Um, <laughs> what was your favourite? Uh, probably. Oh, hard question. Yeah, I know it is because there are lots of good yeah. bits, but, but probably the like that we did a tourist flight over a lake and that was. Oh, wow. And seeing the the mountains from glaciers. there, yeah, it was all glaciers. Yeah, mm. that that was that was really good. That is amazing. Yeah, no, it? no, yeah, amazing yeah. color lake. Yeah. yeah, yeah, really, really nice. Would so, what are you doing? What are you doing? Stop laughing! <laughs> <laughs> Sam's laughing in the background. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't even shown you yet. Right. I haven't been... move it along. <laughs> Like, move along now. Along. Move on to the craft. Yes. Go yes. on. What are you crafting? I've been making buttons. <laughs> of course you. <laughs> it's, it's like a... What's mum doing? Buttons. Buttons. They're large size buttons. I've made one into a brooch, but um... so they're not practical. <laughs> practical i don't think so i think a brooch is practical i think they're whimsical but it's not a practical. button then is it oh i think you could use them as a button on your clothes oh okay yeah but I not might. okay yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 it always seems like you're making buttons i do love buttons. does like making I buttons do love yeah buttons. No, that's true <laughs> did you have coffee and tin tams Mum's trying to make me uh, stop recording now, but I'm just going to carry on recording.